Hi, I'm Barb Rickards, and I'm currently sitting at the RFBA, um, and I am um, being asked to discuss my um, fundraising initiative that allows me to come here at least every six or eight months. And it all began in 2019. And the reason I chose this particular charity is I'm also a lunchroom uh, supervisor at a public school. And when I see children bringing their lunch to school and it consists of very old bread and ketchup as the staple, it, it just made the tears well up in my eyes. So in order to collect money and put it to good use, this is what I chose. And what happened initially was that my niece's son played hockey and he was having a training session very early morning and he was at the um, Fort William Gardens. So my husband and I went to the, um, to, the, to the gardens to watch and while we were there, there were uh, fellows cleaning up from the hockey game that had occurred the night before. And what they were throwing away were beer cans. And it struck me that there's a method to picking all this up and putting it in the garbage, which just goes into landfill. And I thought these things could be retrieved by someone and they're 10 cents each. Long story short, since 2019, I put out a plea to anybody I know and anybody that they know that is willing to donate beer cans, wine bottles, liquor bottles, wine box bladders, and from 2019 to this August, I've been successfully collecting $6,000, which would have been, in all likelihood, gone into landfill. So I have two uh, business associations. I'd like more. If there's anybody out there, just get in touch with me. I will come to your house, wherever it is, or your dwelling, I will collect what you're offering me and I'll turn it into cash. I am going for my 7,000. My goal is 10. And if I'm still young enough to maneuver and drive around, I will be doing it up to $10,000. Thank you. Appreciate anything that can be done for us.